three, two. What up, Rap Pack? It's your boy here, King Raptor, back with another video. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. And if you guys aren't, you know the drill. Camera, flip! It's about to get a whole lot brighter, Rap Pack, because your boy is here. And not only your boy is here, your boy Benjamin from the band, you know, Breaking Benjamin. Yeah, here's one of them right here. He's the, the unbroken one. <laughs> we have a Benjamin air gun, guys. This was sent to me to use exclusively today. I do not own this. This was sent for me to use in this video and this video only. And my only goal today is not to break it, okay? <laughs> I'm gonna get two goals today, but two deals, two goals is one, don't break it. Two, number goal number two, don't kill us. Okay. Yeah, that's, that's two good goals. Yeah, I should be a successful at least one of them. So inside of here, if you guys wanna know what a Benjamin is, this is the air gun. But not just an air gun, guys. This is literally one of the most powerful air guns in the world. It shoots that. <laughs> Let me one second look at a regular air gun pellet so you get an idea real quick. Okay, so here we have a regular air gun bullet. Not oh really doing God. much. We're going to be using this again, guys. I only have this for today, so I can't say there's going to be a part two to this. Enjoy it. So we're going to open it up right now. Let's see what the gun looks like. I've already seen it because it's a, like I said, this is a, this is a pin open. This is a test copy. So here we go. Ready? Do it, do it. Oh! Wow. <laughs> if you wow. guys don't know, it's made by the same people that made the air bow. That's why I had the connection to get this one. That looks like it, huh? Yeah, actually very similar. It's, it's very sleek. Okay, so here's the air bow. If you guys haven't seen this, this is a gun that shoots an arrow at 3,000 PSI. Did a couple videos on that. They look very, very similar. It's like the same body style. Uh, yeah, it's the same thing. <laughs> so here we go. This is it, guys. This thing, if you guys want to know the power on this, a lot of you guys are like, oh, well, you don't have a gun. You, you, don't, you, don't, have a, you don't have a gun. You don't have a gun. <laughs> How you live in California? You got no rules, you got no laws, no, 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 no amendments, no rights. <laughs> but this thing, because it's an air gun, it's actually legal where I live. It shoots stronger than a nine millimeter. We're gonna get started with this, guys. Again, like I said, I am not an expert, and that's what makes things funnier. You know, <laughs> you know a, a gun like that needs a name. Yeah, I probably shouldn't be holding it like this either. We're gonna call it Jane. We'll call it the Diary Series. Yeah, Jane, it's the Diarrhea of Jane. I get it. The diarrhea? Diary of Jane. The yeah. Diarrhea of Jane. Same thing. Diary Okay guys, so what we're gonna be using this for is shooting a bunch of ridiculously satisfying targets. I know you guys love that. So right here, that's how it works. So you pull it back, bolt action, Whoa. oh yeah. You remove this magazine, which is really convenient when you've been shooting an air bow, we have to load every single time. <laughs> so you grab that. So we're gonna load all of these in there and then we're gonna do a test fire to make sure everything's working great. Okay, so we have it loaded. Now let me show you guys our setup here, okay? So I bought this thing. This is made to catch actual bullets. First off, feel how hard that rubber is. <laughs> like wow. this thick of just rubber and then there's this metal plate in the back to stop the bullet So Ooh, okay. this is hopefully supposed to be able to stop the bullet and then if that doesn't work We got this thing too, which is kind of redundant, but when it comes to safety redundancy is probably necessary So we're gonna shoot one shot The reason we're testing this is to first off see if there's any ricochet issues and to see if this target is actually going to work So here we go ready So what if it ricochets and say hits one of us? It'll probably hurt a lot. <laughs> yeah, I think basically those wouldn't do shit if it really came back at us Oh yeah <laughs> You see, I put on my glasses, now I'm protected. Oh, okay, now we're in no danger, great. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, three, two, one. <laughs> wow. That was very, very loud. What'd you say? Okay, it seems like we're alive, right? Okay, so that's good. Oh, dude, it just straight went right through you, right? How does that fit in there? You know, I said the same thing last night. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so on the back here. This, Whoa! Oh, dude, you can feel it warp. So we went through all that rubber. Let's pull it out and see if we can get the bullet. Okay, well, there's the bullet. Disintegrated. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Smoke. <laughs> dude, that is the bullet. <laughs> So, it seems like everything's working here. Now that, that was super smooth. All right, so if you haven't been convinced on the strength of this yet, right here, we have a cooking pan. We're gonna go ahead and put that right there and give that a try, right? Three, two, one. Oh my god. Like I said, if you were still questioning the strength that's on it. That's a perfect hole. <laughs> wow. So that's what we're working with today. Let's shoot some satisfying sh I am very excited. <laughs> All right, first satisfying target. We're going over the classic Sam Cole. This is definitely the Ooh. most we've ever lined up. I don't know exactly what to expect. We got one day with this thing. We got 24 hours with it. I'm trying. All right, how many do you think it's going to shoot through, Parker? At least nine. There's 11 in total. He says nine. You guys guess down below. How many am I going to hit between? One and eleven. Three, two, one. I think I was right. <laughs> I think they're all, they're all everywhere. They're gone. Know, you know, normally they all stay here. Not one stay on the table. <laughs> one, two, it. three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Eleven. They're, they can't run. What? Eleven. 
Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so next we're gonna be shooting this one right here. I'm gonna aim for the cap. I shook this up. You see how he scratches? I shook this up so much. I think it's harder than steel. <laughs> Three, two, one. Well, it worked. <laughs> yeah. Oh Dude, my god. Look at this. It tore straight through. You know, we've seen a lot of stuff on this channel, but <laughs> nothing like that. Okay, let me um, go take a shower, and then uh, we'll get back to you guys. <laughs> All right, for this one, my goal is to go right down the nipple. So when I shoot this, we should see a hole that's just right there. Big old melon. You, you say nipple because you can't really say what it really looks like, right? What does it really look like? Nothing. nothing. Like a butt, <laughs> little piece of shit <laughs> coming out of it. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Three, two. Oh my god! It literally <laughs> created a cavity through it. But that's not just it. Look at the backside. <laughs> Anybody want some watermelons? I got, I got pieces to split. <laughs> oh my god, dude, touch this. Like, this is regular watermelon. Phil, touch this first. Yeah, now, touch okay. this. <gasps> Emulsified. It's, dude, it's, it's, it's like, like literally like slime. Dude, that is ridiculous. Ridiculous. So that cavity you saw, that would be a goddamn zombie's heart. <laughs> if a zombie was ripped. <laughs> yeah, do something else. Just do something else. Okay, so we saw what it did to one stone. Let's see what it'll do to five. So far, I don't know what to expect, but hopefully everything just is, again is okay. I hope it's uh fantastic. It will be fantastic. Yeah. <laughs> Three, two, one. Oh my god. I'm not sure what happened, but I'm definitely wet. This thing makes a very big mess. Literally, it is every. Oh my god. Nothing's ever gone there. Dude, that window's open. You can make sure everyone. I didn't think it was gonna go 20 feet that way. Alright, so we checked the slow mo and the bullet got misdirected because of the carbonation, so I'm just gonna shoot that one. Wow. Never gets quieter. That one is just a different target. That one just was pissing me off for staying alive. Okay, so like the last target, I'm expecting a huge, huge mess. Hopefully that's right. not the case. Three, two, one. <laughs> well, Damn. I'm not sure what is happening. They all got shot, but the thing is, I don't really know exactly. Oh, dude. I thought these ones didn't get hit. Oh. <laughs> Oh, they all got wow! Oh, dude, dude, dude it looks like Naruto or Saiyan. See this little hole right here? Yeah. All right. Oh! Okay, this one has one little hole and one little hole. I'm gonna try and pop those holes open. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Busted the top. <laughs> Didn't work exactly as planned, but as long as something busts, that's, that's my motto in life. As long as I bust, that's all that matters. <laughs> all right, guys, you guys saw the egg sitter test. These are no unbreakable eggs, okay? This is regular eggs. In the last satisfying shooting video, I tried to shoot the air bow and get all 18 eggs in one shot. I did not complete. I think I missed like six or seven of them. I'm trying to go for redemption today with the bulldog here and see if we can get all of them, all right? Three, two, one. Oh, it landed on my finger. <laughs> Everywhere. You know what? That is like the first time I didn't get anything on me. Look at that. <laughs> you got a little bird after birth little... on you. Dude! Yes! Every let's go! One. Every single one! How? It Wait, worked. No. <laughs> Nonetheless, the exit? it worked. Oh, that was repulsive. Separate the white from the yolk. Now here's just the yolk. Oh! Hi! And the egg champion. The I don't know what that means. Egg champion! Comments down below. Alright, next we're gonna be trying Prego, okay? The tomato, basil, garlic powder in it, okay? Three, two, one. Oh. Get rained down, Marinara! Oh, it's so gross! It smell like an Italian supper. Oh, man, dude, I don't even know where it went. Are you serious? It only hit the one? Yeah, I think I the bullet got reached your deck in somewhere. Oh wait, Ursh, yes it did go in and then... It, did it crack it? It's in there! It ha oh, you don't have to do all that! Come on, Bullet, I know oh, you're wait, in stop, there! Stop, 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 stop. Get some ASMR in there. <laughs> oh! Dude! Wow. It popped the back of that one and then got lodged in the second one. That's actually incredible. It was incredible, but, but this wasn't worth it. Okay, guys, so this is a perfect example of what I was telling you guys about the air bow. Notice how the air bow has a lot more penetrative power when we use that. If you don't know what I'm talking about, the air bow play clip. Three, two, one. The air bow is basically, that's why I was trying to tell you guys in that video, a lot of people were saying that like, oh, well, it's not necessarily true, but yeah, an arrow holds more kinetic energy than a bullet does. So a bullet, as soon as it got to the back of this, it flattened and exploded the whole thing. An arrow, it has so much kinetic energy, it just keeps going. So that's the difference. Guns explode things. Arrows go through things. That's the difference. 
Okay, so as I mentioned to you guys, we only have this. This is only for 24 hours. Literally, I have to give it back. And in that 24 hours, I've managed to get marinara sauce on it, egg, soda, and any everything else so far. So far. Yeah. <laughs> They're probably not going to send me anything else, huh? Okay, guys. So next target, we're going to be using this because I want to show you guys what the path actually looks like. So hopefully on the slow-mo cam, you should be able to see it in the middle. That's the goal here. I have a backup plan if this doesn't work because the thing I want to tell you guys is this was able to do this. An air bow would not be able to do this. But but the airbow was able to go through three cans of Prego, which this didn't. It's all about kinetic energy. So hopefully maybe something cool should happen to this thing. And I'm also interested to see if it's even gonna shoot through it because I've also read online that bullets do not travel through water very well, which arrows actually kind of do. So I don't really know if it's gonna even go all the way through, which would be even cooler if we get to see that in the slow-mo. Three, two, one. What? Dude, what? it didn't shoot through! Ooh. Okay! Dude, the bullet! Okay. So this thing shot through a pan! But it couldn't shoot through plastic. Why? Because the resilience of water! Dude, the bullet is literally in there. <laughs> that means, wow. guys, this is what I'm talking about, about energy. Somebody in the comments explained to me how it can shoot through a pan, but it can't shoot through water. I kind of know how it works, but I know somebody out there knows even better than me. Oh! Dude. Whoa, dude, the bullet is like semi unaffected. Okay. It's semi unaffected. <laughs> <laughs> it's either affected or it's not. <laughs> when I get bullied in school, but I try to act like it's okay, I'm only just semi affected. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, so we're gonna do the fish tank this time. Time. And if this doesn't break both sides, I am going to be first off, fill off in this glasses. I am gonna be pissed if a bullet goes through here, travels, and then goes ding, on this side and doesn't break it. I'll be like, what the Are you ready, Park? Yep, Mark. <laughs> I don't know why I called you Park. It is weird. I and mean, you call me Mark, and it's just I do that again. Yeah. Okay? <laughs> Three, two, one, hit it. <laughs> no! No! It didn't break the other side! What in the world? Bruh. How? How does this happen? You're telling me a nine millimeter bullet went through here. It went through a pan. Let's not forget that, okay? It went through here and ding on the back because the water stopped it. Water is amazing. It's almost like we need it to live. Yeah, at least a gallon a day. Man, that's crazy. What would we do without water? Die. That sounds nice. <laughs> How can it do this, but it can't shoot through damn water? You guys tell me down below. But that's it for this one, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did, make sure to smash that like button, subscribe if you're new here, and check out this video right here, guys, which is actually the last video where we shot satisfying things using an air bow. It's literally a gun just like this one, but it shoots a damn arrow. And it actually goes through a lot more stuff because I guess a kinetic energy. Check that video out right there, guys. And as always, I'll see you beautiful people in the next one. Rep back. Adios. Bloop.